Hello everyone. Today I've got for you a completely random selection of informal expressions and words that I've come across over the past couple of weeks. There's no theme at all, it's just a random selection. Let me start off with a, an abbreviation that I think many of you will know, namely TLC, which stands for Tender Loving care. It's something you can use in connection with persons. Uh, you see someone who's a bit sad, uh, a bit worse for wear, and you say something like, ah, oh, you clearly need some TLC. But it can also be used of things. Yeah. Uh, things that haven't been cared for, haven't been maintained. This bike clearly needs some TLC. Second on my list is the word wonky. Wonky means not straight or just not in good order. You can talk of, for instance, a wonky wheel, a wheel that's, for instance, wobbling a bit. It doesn't look good, it's wonky. Then close in meaning to wonky, you have dodgy. Dodgy also meaning not okay. Uh, it can be used in general, that ladder looks a bit dodgy, but very often it's used in connection with things that are not entirely legal. And you could talk of, for instance, a dodgy deal. Number four on my list is the expression, that's the ticket, which people use to say that something is exactly what they wanted, exactly what they needed. Uh, you come across something which completely fits you and you say, ah, that's the ticket. Number five is a nuts whisker. Uh, a whisker or whiskers, you know what they are. Uh, they're the hairs that, for instance, a cat has uh, on its face. Uh, small things. A gnat is a very small biting insect. Think a very small mosquito. So if a gnat is small, a gnat's whisker is very, very small. And that's exactly what it means. It means the tiniest of margins. It's uh, usually used uh, as by a gnat's whisker, uh, by a very tiny margin, or within a gnat's whisker, uh, within uh, a very tiny uh, area within, within a very tiny margin. The next item on my list, uh, number six if I'm not mistaken, is not exactly the nicest of words. It's pillock. And pillock means a silly, stupid person. And it's mostly used as an in insult. You pillock. And then I'm running off with smitten. Smitten which means instantly, suddenly have come by love, by liking for someone or something. Uh, the moment I saw that restored old timer, I was absolutely smitten. Uh, it actually comes from uh, a verb which is hardly ever used anymore, uh, the verb to smite. It's old fashioned, it's literary, and to smite means or meant uh, to strike forcefully or to hit very hard. And you can see then that smitten, uh, the past participle, can uh, get that meaning of uh, head over heels in love all of a sudden. I hope you found this interesting. If you did, give me a like. Don't hesitate to subscribe or to put something in the comments. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.